If you are a freelancer, contractor, have a side hustle, or you're selling a product or service in person or online, you have a business and you need a business bank account. I'm talking to my gig workers like Uber and Lyft drivers. If you deliver for Uber Eats, DoorDash, or Instacart, virtual assistants, bloggers, online boutique owners, hairstylists, makeup artists, if you make t-shirts, if you do lashes, if you sell on Etsy, if you're a photographer, a YouTuber, a monetized Instagram or TikTok influencer, can you see where I'm going here? If you have a side hustle, you need a business checking account. You should not be mixing your personal and your business money in one account. Having a business account is going to make it easier for you to separate your business from your personal expenses and help you during tax time. And it's super easy to get one. In this video, I'm going to help you choose the best business bank account that is right for your business. For those of you who are new here, welcome. My name is Sean Chalice, and on my channel, we talk all things finance with a focus on making extra money. I take you on my journey to financial freedom and share what I've learned so you can do the same. When starting your search for a business bank account, the first thing you might realize is you have no idea what features you should be looking for, especially since most of us choose our personal bank account based on who our parents or people close to us bank with. And if we need to make a change, we usually go for convenience. Or you can be like me, someone who as a kid thought banks were the coolest thing ever, and now you bank with pretty much all of them for no good reason, just because you can. When it comes to banking for your business, you need to put some thought into the features that you need. You want to a bank that works with how your business operates. For example, an interior designer will need different features than an online boutique owner because an interior designer will work with large cash or check deposits and an online boutique owner will have lots of digital transactions. When choosing a business checking account, you should consider things like fees, minimum opening balance, how you can send and receive funds, and transaction limits. The most common fee that you'll encounter with your business checking account is the monthly maintenance fee. You can be charged this fee just by having an open account. Some additional fees that you'll need to look out for are transaction fees, cash deposit fees, overdraft fees, wire transfer fees, and foreign transaction fees. Understanding how you do business will help you make smart decisions on which accounts to choose so that you can avoid paying excessive fees. Some business accounts require you to make an initial deposit when you open your account. The amount will vary depending on the account. However, there are many options that do not require a minimum opening balance. We are far from the days where the only way to access our money is by going into a physical bank branch. Now we can send and receive money using ATMs, wire transfers, ACH transfers, checks, and online bill pay. When choosing your business bank account, it is helpful to know what methods are available to send and receive money to ensure that your account works the way you do business. This is an area that is easy to miss when reviewing the features of a checking account for your business, mainly because these types of limits are not common for personal accounts. So you may not be aware that you need to look out for them. Some limits that you might see on business checking accounts are transaction limits and cash deposit limits. If you have over a certain number of transactions or deposit over a certain amount of cash into the account, you can be charged fees. As I go through the accounts on my list, I'll tell you how each account ranks in each of these categories. I'll also tell you about extra features that might be helpful for your business. All of the accounts on my list are FDIC insured and have websites that allow you to manage your account online and mobile apps that will allow you to bank on the go. I won't spend much time on these features as I go through each account, but they all are top notch in this area. There's no need to write down any of this information. I have provided a link in the the description to a PDF that you can use to compare each of these accounts and choose the one that is right for you. The first business bank account on my list is Relay. I've been banking with Relay for a few years now, and they keep getting better and better by adding more and more features. Relay is an online business banking and money management platform designed for small businesses. Relay is a financial technology company, not an FDIC insured bank. Their banking services and FDIC insurance is provided by Thread Bank. Relay offers two types of accounts, Relay and Relay Pro. The Relay account is free and gives you all of your business banking and essentials without a monthly fee. The Relay Pro account is $30 per month per business and you get everything in the Relay account plus accounts payable, faster ACH, and free wire payments. When we look at how Relay stacks up in our categories of fees, minimum balance requirements, transactions, sending and receiving funds, and special features, you'll see why Relay is at the top of my list. Relay has no monthly fees, overdraft fees, or bounce check fees. There are also no ATM withdrawal fees when using Alpoint ATMs. You can bank freely without worrying about cutting into your profit. 
Relay doesn't have a minimum balance requirement. This means that you do not have to deposit a certain amount of money to open your account, and you do not have to maintain a certain balance to keep the account open without fees. With Relay, you get unlimited transactions. Relay gives you multiple ways to receive and send money. You can deposit and withdraw cash from any AllPoint ATM for free. There are over 55,000 AllPoint ATMs across the United States. You can do incoming and outgoing ACH transfers, mobile check deposits, both domestic and international incoming and outgoing wire transfers. Incoming wires, both domestic and international, are free, while outgoing domestic wires are $5 and outgoing international wires are $10. Relay's no monthly fees or minimum balances. Pretty cool, but this is going to be standard for most of the business banking accounts on my list. So let's talk about some of Relay's special features that make them really stand out. With Relay, you get up to 20 no-fee checking accounts. These are individual accounts with their own unique account numbers. You can create these accounts yourself inside of your Relay online account. This feature is perfect for those of us with multiple streams of income. You can have a separate account for each of your income streams. For example, I have multiple Etsy accounts and I sell on TikTok shop and Amazon. I'm able to allocate a separate checking account for each of these selling channels. I can clearly see how each selling channel is doing and it makes bookkeeping super easy. Relay also gives you up to 50 virtual or physical debit cards. Now, why would your business need 50 debit cards? Hold that thought. Relay is designed for you to give banking privileges to your team. You can give team members access to your Relay account and limit their access to see just what they need to see. This also includes your bookkeeper. You can also give your team members their own debit cards. My Etsy business is run by a small team of contractors. I'm not a part of the day-to-day -day operations. My operations manager has access to my Relay accounts that are related to Etsy. She also has her own debit card to use to make purchases from our vendors. I'm not worried about her overspending because I can set spending limit. I am no longer a roadblock in my Etsy business. They don't need me when they need to go get supplies or purchase blanks. They are empowered to work efficiently and I have full control over their spending. Relay also has business savings accounts. You might find it hard to save within your business, but having a savings account makes it easier by giving you a separate place to save your money. You can create up to two savings accounts and Relay's business savings accounts have no monthly fees and no minimum balances. You earn interest and that interest is paid out monthly at the end of the month. Opening a Relay account is pretty easy and it takes about 10 minutes. I have a full video that will walk you through the process. I have it linked above me in the cards and in the description. To open a Relay account, you'll need a government issued photo ID or passport, social security number, personal address and phone number, business address and phone number, email address. You also need to upload certain business documents with your application. For a limited time, Relay will give you $100 when you open a new Relay account and fund it with $100. To qualify, you have to not already have a Relay account, meaning you are a new Relay customer, and you must deposit at least $100 into your Relay account. Let me clarify, you do not need to deposit $100 to open an account with Relay. Relay does not require a minimum balance, but to qualify for this promotion, you must deposit at least $100 into your new Relay account. Look down in the description right now to see if you still have time to qualify for this promotion. The next business banking account on my list is Novo. Novo offers free business checking accounts with no minimum balance designed to meet the needs of small businesses and startups. Novo provides you with integrated business tools, automated budgeting, and fast payment options so you can spend less time managing your finances and more time running your business. Novo is a fintech company and not a bank. The banking services and FDIC insurance is provided through Middlesex Federal Savings FA. When we look at how Novo stacks up in our categories, you'll see why Novo is number two on my list. Novo is free from account fees. They have no monthly fees, no hidden fees, and no non-sufficient fund fees. Novo also does not have any minimum balance requirements. You do not have to deposit a certain amount of money to open an account, and you do not have to maintain a certain balance to keep your account open without fees. With Novo, you get unlimited transactions. You cannot deposit cash with the Novo business banking account, but you get ATM fee refunds up to $7 per month. You also get a business debit card. With Novo, you get fast money movement with free ACH, mail checks, and incoming wires with express availability. Incoming wires, both domestic and international, are free. 
Novo is also not lacking in area of special features. Reserves allow you to automate budgeting for up to 10 categories. Think of reserves like budgeting envelopes where you can separate your money to save for things like taxes and emergency savings. Novo Invoices allows you to send invoices to your customers for free. There is no limit on the number of invoices you can send, and Novo Invoices support both one-time and recurring invoices. This is a standout feature for me. When I get large custom shirt orders, I send my customers invoices. It would be so convenient to send invoices directly from my business bank account and have the money drop right into my account. No more transferring it over to the proper account from a third party service. Nova also has integrations that allow you to seamlessly integrate with business tools like Stripe, Wise, Square, Shopify, and QuickBooks, allowing you to streamline operations, enhance productivity, and drive your growth. You can apply for your Novo account in only 10 minutes and I tested this myself. The application process was easy and my account was approved quickly. To open a Novo account, you need a copy of your signed personal identification, a mobile phone using one of the major U.S. carriers, a social security number, a U.S. address, and all applicants must be at least 18 years old. And depending on your business type, they may require certain documents. The next business banking account on my list is Bluevine. Bluevine's business checking is similar to a lot of the accounts on my list with one major difference. It allows you to earn interest on your account. To qualify to earn interest on your account, you have to meet one of two qualifications. You have to spend $500 per month with your Bluevine Business Debit MasterCard in store, online, and through digital wallets or mobile payment platforms, or receive $2,500 per month in customer payments into your Bluevine business checking. When running a business, these are pretty easy requirements to qualify for, especially as your business grows. Bluevine is a financial technology company, not a bank. Their banking services and FDIC insurance are provided by Coastal Community Bank. Let's look at how Bluevine stacks up in our categories. Bluevine has no monthly fees or overdraft fees, and you can move money with free standard ACH transfers. Bluevine also does not have any minimum balance requirement, and you get unlimited transactions. Bluevine supports free standard ACH and incoming wires, same-day ACH, domestic wires, printed and mail checks, and international wires. There are fees associated with their same-day ACH wires and payments via check. Bluevine also offers mobile check deposits and a business debit card. You can deposit cash with your Bluevine debit card at over 91,500 locations nationwide and withdraw cash at over 3,700 no-fee ATMs. As I mentioned earlier, Bluevine is the only account on my list that gives you the ability to earn interest. You can earn 2% APY on balances up to and including $250,000 if you meet a monthly activity goal. Bluevine also gives you up to five sub accounts with dedicated account numbers to help you with budgeting. You can set up automatic transfer rules to help you manage the transfer of money between your main account and your sub accounts. To open a Bluevine account, you'll need a government issued photo ID or passport, a mobile phone using one of the major U.S. carriers, a social security number, and a U.S. address. All applicants must be at least 18 years old, and depending on your business type, they may require additional documentation. The next business banking account on my list is Lily. Lily is designed for freelancers and small businesses. They offer four business accounts ranging from basic to premium. Each of their paid accounts come with a 30-day free trial and have a $0 minimum deposit. When just getting started, the Lily Basic gives you a solid business banking account. Lily is a financial technology company, not a bank. Their banking services and FDIC insurance is provided by Choice Financial Group. Let's look at how Lily stacks up in our categories. Lily is no fee banking. They have no minimum fees, no hidden fees, no overdraft fees, no foreign transaction fees, and no ATM fees at 38,000 Money Pass locations. Lily also does not have any minimum balance requirements. With Lily, you get unlimited transactions. With Lily, you can instantly send and receive money using standard and express ACH transfers. You can also receive unlimited fee-free domestic wire transfers. You can connect your Lily account to payment apps like Venmo, PayPal, or Cash App to move money into your account. You can also set up direct deposits to go into your account and link your Lily account to different banks. Lily also supports mobile check deposits. You also get a business debit card, and Lily has multi-user access, allowing each joint account owner to have their 
own business debit card. Lily's first standout feature is an early payment feature that allows you to receive certain ACH payments up to two days early. And you get this feature with the Lily Basic account, which is free. Lily also stands out in accounting and bookkeeping when you upgrade to one of their paid account options. You can instantly categorize transactions to streamline your bookkeeping. With Lily, you can generate financial reports like your expense, profit and loss, and cash flow statement. Reports that you would normally get from third-party services like QuickBooks. Lily also has a business savings account that earns a 4.15 APY on balances up to and including $100,000. APYs are subject to change, so please check their website for the most up-to-date information. You can apply for your Lily account in three steps and it takes less than three minutes. To open a Lily account, you'll need a government-issued photo ID or passport, a mobile phone number using one of the major U.S. carriers, a social security number, and a U.S. address. All applicants must be at least 18 years old and depending on your business type, they may require additional documentation. Next up, we have the only big bank on my list and that is Chase. Chase Business Complete Banking is a good option when you need the backing of a big bank with local branches. This is where I opened my first business checking account. And despite them not being a no fee banking option like Relay, I've always found a use for them. Chase offers a comprehensive list of services which include business credit cards and business loans. And they give you ways to avoid monthly fees and they have delays on the overdraft fees. Let's look at how Chase stacks up in our categories. Chase is not no fee banking. Chase has both the monthly fee and overdraft fees. However, they do give you ways to avoid some of their fees. With their Chase Business Complete Banking, you can waive the $15 monthly service fee if you have a minimum daily balance of $2,000, make $2,000 in purchases on your Chase Inc. business card, have $2,000 deposit from Quick Accept or the merchant services, or if you link a Chase private client checking account. Chase has no minimum opening deposit and no account minimums. You get unlimited electronic deposits. However, your fee-free cash deposits are limited to $5,000 per month and your fee-free physical transactions limit to $20 per month. Chase gives you all of the features of a full-service bank, including physical branches, cash deposits, checks, a business debit card, and access to 16,000 Chase ATMs and 4,700 branches across the U.S. There are multiple ways to send and receive funds, including ACH, Zelle, Wire transfers, Chase Quick Deposit, and Chase Online Bill Pay. When it comes to special features, for Chase, we have their Chase Quick Accept feature. It allows you to accept credit card payments from your customers anywhere in the U.S. This feature is perfect if you have a business where you sell in person or over the phone. You get same-day deposits with no additional fees. You can enter card transactions, issue refunds, track disputes, and more. There are no hidden fees or monthly contracts. Chase also has a point-of-sale app and a card reader that will allow you to take credit card payments with your phone. To open a Chase account, you'll need personal identification, two forms of ID, including at least one issued by government, such as a state-issued driver's license or passport, tax identification number or social security number, ITN or EIN, business documentation, which depends on your business structure, and doing business as name if you have one. All of the accounts on my list are good options for your business banking need. Relay is my top pick with Novo running a close second. And I do find having a big bank or even a local credit union handy when you need a local option. Use the link in the description to download my business banking 2024 PDF that will give you a summary of all the accounts that I've gone over so you can choose the one that meets your business needs. Remember, the only way you can go wrong is by not choosing at all. You can also watch this video right here to learn more about Relay.